Hot Wheels Racers, pick your lane! Oh, Hawkeye Holler Nation, stand up and welcome back to the channel. Thank you guys again for tuning in. This is the Decide Your Ride for our second monster truck, King of the Hill. 16 beautiful BBTs have rolled into the hauler. And I tell you what, this is a stellar lineup. We are going to have a lot of fun with this King of the Hill. This is some knockdown, drag them out trucks right here. Who's it going to be? Our current monster truck, King of the Hill, going for two-time king is steer clear. He's your reigning, defending, undisputed monster truck king of the hill. How well will he fare against his opponents? Well, we're going to see which one of these contenders has what it takes to make it to the king round. So this is open to anybody. So get your picks in. And yes, you may be sharing a ride with somebody that's A-OK. -okay. I got to give a huge thank you to my YouTube members and my Patreon members for showing their support for the channel. Seriously guys, thank you so much. It's greatly appreciated. I do wanna to apologize to my Ultimate members. I gotta get that Ultimate package sent out. It's gonna be a bigger one, just like a few months back when I got a few months behind. So I'm gonna send you a box of stuff for June and July. Hopefully I can get that out here sometime this weekend. So again, bear with me. Thank you guys so much for that. And again, thank you for the continued support. Here on Hawkeye Holler 1, that's what we gotta call it now. We're on the road to 10,000 subscribers. We are closing in on 9,400 Hawkeye Holler members. So seriously guys, thank you so very much. You guys are truly awesome. One of you will be walking away with that Hot Wheels ID track set. Now, over on Hawkeye Holler 2, linked down below, we are racing Hot Wheels, so go, go over there, show your love for that channel, and help me get to 1,000 subscribers over there as well. Having Race Wars, that is our king of the hill for Hawkeye Holler 2. A lot of people, a lot of diecast channels do uh, king of the hill, king of the mountain, such like that. For Hawkeye Holler 2, we have Race Wars. Something different, kind of the same format, but you know, just a little bit different. You know, kind of like Fast and Furious, you know what I'm saying? Haha, <laughs> we do it for family around here. Hey guys, don't forget, we do have merch. It is linked down below. It should be linked in this video as well. Go rep your official Hawkeye Holler merch. It does help get the word out there. And you know, why not look cool while watching some diecast racing? Now, we're gonna go ahead and get these lineups going. Now, my Patreon members have had early access to pick their rides. There was a post over there. So again, consider becoming a Patreon member for as little as $1 a month. Gets you premier access to drive your lineups and bonus content. Bonus content is coming soon to Patreon. So again, thank you guys for bearing with me. Any, we are, we're, we're three minutes into this intro. That's way too long. I apologize. Let's get to deciding your rides. Who's it gonna be? All right, our first BBT into this lineup will be Zerg. Oh, I thought we'd be a lot closer to the table than we are. But anywho, Zerg weighs 125 grams. He has a... He has not shown much strength in our seasons, but maybe he can turn it around here for our king of the hill. Look for Zerg to be one hell of a contender. Let's go ahead and roll him on out, then we'll get the next one lined up. All right, next up to the lineup. Come on into frame. Whoa, 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 whoa. We're just going to back you up just a little bit. Wayne, 113 grams. We have the gold Mega Rex. Now we know Mega Rex knows how to get it done on the king of the hill. We've had a Mega Rex in the past become king if you guys haven't seen any of my older monster truck king of the hill videos head back check it out i got a ton of videos for you guys to check out go back check it out but there is mega rex i'm excited for this one next up to our lineup weighing 110 grams we are going to have the land rover defender another beautiful truck i love the desert storm scheme or you know the baja scheme for this truck I'm looking for the Land Rover to be kind of like a sleeper truck, but we'll see how well he fares. That is truck number three. There is the Land Rover. Weighing in at a whopping 120 grams, you are going to have one bad scoop. And that dairy delivery body style, man, oh man, these dairy delivery trucks, again, know how to get it done on the King of the Hill. Seen a couple dairy deliveries, you know, triple D, become a king in the past you know he, he's fared well on most other tracks but one bad scoop does carry a lineage of that dairy delivery body style he's going to be tough to beat i'm excited to see how this one does 
All right, weighing in at 100 grams, you got the Back to the Future DeLorean. Again, another fan favorite looking to make a scene, make a splash to say. Now, in the past for our Monster Truck King of the Hills, this truck has been very competitive. I believe they almost made it to a King round. They at least made it to the Final Four, maybe even the Contender round, but they did not go all the way, unfortunately. Again, weighing 100 grams, he's gonna be tough. Light on his feet, let's see how well he fares. Making his debut to a monster truck, King of the Hill, weighing 103 grams, you have Samson. I am really looking forward to seeing Samson compete in our first King of the Hill. Yes, we did have drag racing for a season, but uh, he wasn't a part of that. This Samson was only in the pit, I believe, when we had our season strictly for the pit, so this will be his first time here on the drag strip. Really looking forward to seeing what Samson can do. I think we're going to have a lot of people choosing him. He is up to bat. Another legend has entered the chat. That is the OG Bigfoot, weighing 100 grams. Again, another light truck. Samson's a little bit heavier. He has those fists on the front, but I'm looking for Bigfoot to make some noise. Maybe fight for a king, uh, you know, a king's crown. We've seen Bigfoot come in when it was most needed, like back when we had our 25 days of a Monster Xmas. He was the last truck to qualify, even with some seasons we've had. He is a, he's last to show up, but man, oh man, he's fun to watch. Bigfoot, moving on. Who lives in a pineapple under the sea? Well, that's SpongeBob SquarePants, weighing 110 grams. He is here to play, man, oh man. Now, this truck right here does seem to get a little loose in the rear axles. He carries that awkward spoiler right here, but I am looking for this SpongeBob to be a little bit different. Look for him to have some momentum. I think he's going to be a popular choice. I mean, I would pick SpongeBob, but my choice is coming up here pretty soon. There is SpongeBob, he's moving out. All right, here we go. Our lightest truck in the field so far, weighing 98 grams, man, oh man, he is a tiny little fella. And this is my pick to win it all right here. This is uh, Demo Ace. Cross between Demo Derby and Race Ace, has that town hauler body style. Man, oh man, one of my favorite trucks from this year absolutely beautiful paint scheme i am hoping this truck can at least make it to the final four hopefully the contender round and hopefully take that crown away from steer clear there is demo ace all right here we go i oh, almost forgot to weigh you in oh, give me one second la, 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 la. oh my goodness the heaviest truck so far weighing 139 grams we got a BBT on our hands, and I mean, this may be a BBBBT. Holy smokes, weighing 139 grams. We got the Red Planet Ranger. Uh, you know, it took me a long time to realize I was saying Red Planet Ranger before, uh, but thank you to those who corrected me in the comments. This is Red Planet Ranger. I think this may be our winner right here. This truck is gonna be hard to beat. Recreational, again, a previous king of the hill. This is a recreational body style. Look for him to be tough. Red Planet Rager, moving out. Weighing in at a nice 100 grams, you got Choo 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 Loco Punk. Again, another one of my favorite monster trucks in my collection. Absolutely love the way Loco Punk looks. Again, this is a truck that has fared very, very, very poorly on King of the Hills, but maybe this one will turn it around. We will just have to see. I definitely wouldn't sleep on him. He may be a great choice, maybe an underdog in this competition. Local Punk rolling out. If anyone's going to be able to go toe to toe with the Red Planet Ranger in one bad scoop, it is the 129 gram Volkswagen Drag Bus. Again, a previous King of the Hill and a season winner a season ago when we had the pit. These drag buses are probably the best monster trucks that can compete on any form of track. They just always seem to be the best. This one. Oh my goodness, this one's gonna be tough to beat. There is the Volkswagen Drag Bus, and he's rolling out. Right, as I get the next truck weighed in, I did wanna let you guys know, for those of you who enjoy ASMR content, we are going to be having some of that over on Hawkeye Holler too. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna test the waters with some Hot Wheels ASMR. We're gonna see how well it fares. I think it's gonna be pretty fun. Just gonna be a race, you know, just some, some casual noise of Hot Wheels racing. All right, weighing in at 109 grams, you got the Mercedes-Benz Unimog. For those of you keeping up with our current monster truck season, which I hope you are, if you haven't, go back, check it out. Got a huge playlist. It will be linked at the end of this video. We are hit, we've hit our halfway point in the season, and I tell you what, the Unimog, 
Oh my goodness. He was quite the surprise. Now there is the Mercedes-Benz Unimog. He's rolling out. All right, here we go. Now you would think this truck right here would be a heavyweight looking at him, but Gotta Dump is not a heavyweight. He weighs 102 grams. He, so he's pretty light. I mean, I, this is again, this is his first drag racing event, his first King of the Hill. I'm curious to see how Gotta Dump's gonna go. Uh, <laughs> that's funny. Got a dump gonna go. Anywho, there is got a dump. He's rolling out. All right, probably the prettiest truck in the bunch, weighing 106 grams. There is Carbonator Double XL. Again, Carbonator has shown some amazing strength on uh, King of the Hill events. Honestly, any event in particular, King of the Hill has done pretty dang well. Looking for him to do, you know, semi right. Maybe he'll be a surprise winner. Maybe he won't. Carbonator. Moving and out. our final truck, truck number 16, weighing 102 grams. Again, a favorite of mine. It is the Gold 5 Alarm. I just love saying gold because I love gold. Anywho, there is the Gold 5 Alarm, weighing 102 grams. Man, again, 5 Alarm was a previous king, our yellow one, but that was by the skin of his teeth. Oh my gosh, that fly's going to drive me crazy. By the skin of his teeth, but he was able to get it done and become king. Now, we'll see how well his gold brethren does. Five alarm, rolling out. All right, Hawkeye Holler Nation, as I was going through our lineup, I was also setting our prelims, our first round of racing, our round of 16. That is how we are set up. We are going to have some amazing racing. So again, this is your time to decide your ride. In the comments down below, drop a name of a truck you want to represent. And please, if you would, just like the video. It does help it out. Uh, so like the video, comment down below. Definitely make sure you subscribe because you're not going to want to miss it if you win. We're going to have some amazing racing here for our second Monster Truck King of the Hill. Going to make it a monthly thing where we will have a Monster Truck King of the Hill event for you guys. That's going to be it. Can Steer Clear defend his crown and become a two-time undefeated Monster Truck King of the Hill? You're going to have to tune in to find out. That's it. Do all the good stuff. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Become part of the Hawkeye Holler Nation Day. It's again your home for Monster Truck die cast racing. We have fun playing with the big boys here, our BBTs. Don't forget Hawkeye Holler 2. We are racing Hot Wheels. Go ahead, show your support today for the channel by becoming a Patreon member for Amazing Tears or a YouTube member right here, $2.99 a month. Get your name on a piece of orange track and many more benefits. That's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Pick some awesome rides. I'm looking forward to those comments. Peace, love, and diecast racing. I am out of here.